Welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Leslie and this is going to be her style diary. Hello. What is her style defined as? I've been pondering lately of what style I am and just can define it. And right now what I'm doing is just being experimental, having an open mind. One thing that my theater professor always told me is that you get to choose who you want to be according to what you're going to wear that day. So I always keep that in mind and I try to just have fun with it. Right now, I'm mostly like in this like French look. Also, just like playing with color, with pattern, um, and just having fun, honestly. Who are your style icons? <laughs> Rihanna and Zendaya. They experiment and they have fun with it and they're just chameleons and that's what I want to be. I want to be able to just be goth one day and then just like dress up in like really nice like modern contemporary stuff. So yeah, those two are nailing it in my opinion. <laughs> what do you find inspiration from and what's your inspiration? I mostly look at a lot of um, celebrities online, like Instagram, magazines. Uh, we have to do a lot of research for Buffalo Exchange, so I get to check out what's like current and trending right now. I also get the best inspiration from friends, so I look at everyone that I see and I just get inspired daily from them too. So. Celebrities and friends. Where do you shop? Girl, <laughs> Buffalo Exchange. I'm too broke to go anywhere else. If I had all the money in the world, I would be going to Sara, I'd be going to Eileen Fisher, Brent Walker. Working at Buffalo Exchange gives you a really great perspective on all these brands that are um, just versatile. So those three are, in my opinion, the ones that go well with the style that I'm trying to go for too, like Topshop too. They're like nice right now. What do you look for when you go shopping? What I try to focus on is just being comfortable and if it's a piece that I want to try, it has to be unique and also can be able to portray me in my personality, my loudness and goofiness, so I try to look for those. So, comfortable, funny, and unique. What are your top pieces in your wardrobe? So, what I'm wearing right now is like the best thing that I purchased at Buffalo Exchange. It has like these really cool buttons and that's the reason why I bought it and I'm gonna wear it until I die. If it falls apart, I'm gonna like sew these buttons to like another blouse or something because yes, there's a geisha, there's an emperor. It's just amazing. I love it. I love it so much. I'm obsessed. <laughs> Have this silk tiger blouse. I don't wear it often because it's silk and it's a little small but yeah I love that. I love tigers so it has tiger like Chinese print all over so that's my that's my baby. And then I have another blouse that has bad bitch embroidered on the on the collar and that one's my best blouse too so I try not to wear them because I sweat a lot because it's Tucson and I ride my bike. What are your signature pieces? I would say right now is culottes, my beret, and this homemade jean it's really uh, cool. choker. Thank you. Yeah. It's safety pin on the back, so sometimes when I laugh, it pops out <laughs> and it pokes me. But yeah, those three pieces I say that um, right now I, I wear all the time. How can the viewers watching get you to look? Just try to have fun with, with what you want. Like, try it and just get pieces, try them out, and you'll be able to see if, if it will work for you. If not, make them work. You can do whatever you want. <laughs>